The World Health Organization described the trend of COVID-19 cases and deaths worrying as both showed an increase for this week. Cherise Nambowan will tell us why live. Yes, Cherise. Carlene, after six weeks of decrease in COVID-19 deaths this week showed a slight increase across the world, which was described as worrying sign by Maria Van Verkuvi, the World Health Organization's COVID-19 technical lead on yesterday's global COVID-19 press conference of WHO. Another worrying trend is the continuous increase in COVID-19 transmission for five weeks now in four of five WHO regions, with 8% increase last week. In Europe, that is 12%, and that's driven by a, a, several countries across the European region. And a lot of that is driven by the B117 variant that was first identified in the UK that is now starting to circulate in many countries in the eastern part of Europe. Um, we've seen an increase of cases of 49% in our Southeast Asia region, which is largely driven by increase in cases in India and in a number of other countries there. In our Eastern to Mediterranean region, we've seen an increase of 8%. And in our Western Pacific region, we've seen an increase in cases of 29%, largely driven by increase in cases in the Philippines and Papua New Guinea. The COVID-19 technical lead also added that there are a very dangerous combination of factors that contribute to the increase of transmission, which are difficulty to comply with proven control measures, uneven and inequitable vaccination distribution, and increased transmission of COVID-19 variants. The WHO also advised to continue to adhere to the individual level measures that keep us and our loved ones safe while COVID-19 vaccinations are rolling out. Harleen? Thank you, Cherise Zambowen, reporting live. MCGI Free Store. Get what you need, not what you want.